Hey guys, welcome back to Hanging with the Kiddos Creative Creations. I'm Latoya and in today's video tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make water bottle labels over on Canva. If you find this video helpful, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and make sure you watch the video till the end. So once you log in to Canva, you want to go to Custom Dimensions. You want to make sure this is in inches and you want to put 8.5 by 2 inches and select create a new design. Okay, so once your blank canvas is pulled up, you can pretty much start designing your water bottle label. And what I like to do from here is kind of create my own template so I can know exactly where I need to place everything. So I will go to elements. I will go to shapes and I'm going to um, size up my size and my size are normally about three inches, three inches by two inches. So, okay, so I resized it two inches height and three inches across and I'm going to move this to the side. And I'm just going to duplicate this. Okay, so now I have my sides and now I have my middle. This is where I can design everything that goes in, that's going to be on the front of the water bottle labels. And these are going to be my sides here. Now from here, you can start just designing your water bottle wrapper. And you can go to the Upload tab and upload any of the clip arts and backgrounds, whatever you want to use. Right here, you can simply use these boxes as your background. You can change the color by just going up to the Color tab and selecting a new color. Or you can add in a photo background if you wanted to. Right, so you have your water bottle wrapper template right here. This is your guide that you need to use. And what I normally do, I create one label. I save it as a PNG file. And then I upload that image to a full 8 by 5 by 11 sheet of paper. And I add about five labels to that sheet of paper and I print and that's it. So I'm going to design the label. I'm going to show you how to upload it and add the label to a full size sheet of paper and I'm going to print and I'm going to assemble a water bottle wrapper for you. Stay tuned.
Okay, so once your design is finished and you're happy with everything, you can rename your file here. Go to the download tab. Make sure it says PNG file. Do not mess with the size and select download. So after you save your first label to your computer, you want to go back to Canva's homepage. Go to custom dimensions and size your paper 8.5 by 11 inches and create a new design. Right from here, you want to go to the upload tab, upload an image, and you want to find the image of your water bottle label that you save. Once it has uploaded, you want to click on it to add it to your page. From here, you may have to resize it the length but don't mess with the height you're going to resize it to fit the page which is 8.5 it should be 8.5 by 2 you're going to bring it all the way up to the top of your page make sure everything is centered another way that you can make sure you have your image centered correctly you can click your image go to the position tab is not center you can click on the center tab from here you can just duplicate your labels to fill up your page and you can fit about five labels per page And you want to save this as a PDF and download. Alright, so now I have my labels printed out and for this example I just printed this out on glossy photo paper but for water bottle labels you want to make sure you're using a waterproof paper. Online labels have um, a weatherproof glossy um, sticker paper that works great. It's not gonna, the ink is not gonna mess up if the labels get wet. So online labels has this. I'll try to link this paper down in the description box down below. And it gives you that same look as this glossy paper, except for the ink is not going to um, mess up if it gets wet. And since this is not um, sticker paper, I'm just going to use some tape to, um, to put it on the water bottle.